All right, guys, what's going on? It's better by the day. If you're new here, bro, just get a little bit better each and every single day, man. Just keep working hard. Uh, this is the start of the new year, dude. Day one went great. Day two is going to be even better. Uh, definitely not day one and two of my journey overall, but uh, day one and two of uh, this year. So, um, dude, the new year, it's a fresh restart. It's You get a good restart. Everything's ready to go. It doesn't matter, bro. Even if it was yesterday, even if it was two days ago, a year ago, whatever it may be, it's all in the past. Now it's a new year. This is the year that you decide to be great. This is the start of a new era. You know, it might be the first day, it might be the first day of a new year, but it also can be the first day of a new generation of a new generation of yourself, a new era for yourself, whatever, whatever you want to call it. So um, take that opportunity, take that reset and use it to your advantage, bro. Like leave everything, everything negative behind and look forward positively to everything else. And at the same time, like I say that, but dude, you don't need, you don't need a, a certain day, a certain holiday to reset. You can reset whenever you want. Like I, that's something that I feel like is just so many people like put something off like, Oh, like I'll stop then, or I'm waiting for this, or I'll do it until that, like get it out of my system. No, bro. If, if something's not right and something's not good for you, you stop it now. It doesn't matter what day it is. It doesn't matter what else you got to do. Um, you just move on from it right then and there. Like I just, and then even if you like come back to it at some point, cause you don't think you were ready, at least you've like made those first couple steps. The first couple steps are always the hardest. Just never, I mean, dude, people have put stuff off for so long. You just, you don't put stuff off. You just, you get it out of the way and you move on from it. And, uh, you only do the things that make you happy, make you better, make you, make you, you. So yeah, I mean, today's day number two, um, never put anything off getting ready to go today. Uh, back day, some cardio, man, just living the dream, man. Whatever, whatever, uh, whatever we encounter today, I'm ready for it and I can't wait for it. So I'll see you guys at the workout, man. I'll, let's go. All right, so I always started off with the rows. Here's 225. I think this is a set of 15, bro. Really happy with this. Form stays pretty consistent. Uh, looking back, like would like to be bent over a little more, but as you uh, as you watch, uh, you tend to notice the, the small things that you would change, but felt pretty good about this. Then moved on to some real heavy reps. I think I got this for a set of seven, and that's huge. I usually can only do this for like a set of five. And again, like pretty happy with the form. And the thing you had to keep in mind, guys, is these are my top sets, my heaviest sets. The forms are going to be compromised a little bit. If you guys want me to start including like the more concentrated controlled form, like let me know in the comments or whatever. And then moved on to pull-ups. Um, I did think I have put on a little bit of weight over the last couple of weeks over the holidays. So again, I think this is 15, which is or around there, which is around what I usually am. So pretty happy with that considering the extra weight. Uh, moved on to some rows. Again, top set, this isn't my longest set. This is just trying to get a lot of weight on there, throw it around. Uh, feel pretty good about it and um, I definitely did and then after I do these rows I then move on to the curls and again 135 curls you know I love to include these on Tuesday really push my limits uh, set of two or uh, I think I get a set of three and then really try and push a fourth and again these are swinging a little bit but I mean dude 135 curl like I mean it's it's tough it's tough but I just like to push the limits and then here's my um this is a so again this is a more concentrated bicep movement i'm really trying to like do things where i move the elbows around really trying to grow the arms and this is a uh, one of the forward motions i really feel this one i really like this one and again this is my top set um again a little more reps considering i went heavier on the standing uh, barbell curls but again overall just felt really good burning it out a little bit at the end neck veins flaring i mean you can't ask for much more it felt pretty solid What's going on guys, back and by day. Just got, got a really good back and by workout in today and then I just uh, just cranked out some cardio, crushed some cardio, bro. And I just wanted to say, bro, I went so hard today in my um, back and by. Dude, when I was doing my cardio, something right here was hurting, like in my upper form. And I didn't really hit forms last week and I crushed them yesterday and I hit them somewhat hard today. And dude, I'm, I'm trying to run. And just because I went so hard this morning, something in my arms hurting. And that's just what I want to say is, bro, something's always going to hurt. You know, I'm running and something in my arms hurting that can't, that can't take away from your goal, bro. That can't be something that hinders your progress or hinders your success. It's something you have to push through and get used to it. And you know, like I said, only 2.5 miles today, but like when I started doing cardio at the end of summer, 0.3 miles on the treadmill tops, bro. That was, that was all I had in me. That was all I could do. So still get 2.5 miles on. The other thing is, is trying to build up to cardio days on Wednesday and Saturday, do big days, try and crush some miles, PRs, maybe some time, maybe some distance PRs and just, you know, get after it as a whole. So you know, really no complaints, just trying to work hard, push through everything. 
Yeah, I crushed some forearms today. Got, let me know if you guys wanted me to start sharing some forearm stuff. I got some pretty good forearm tricks up my sleeve. Um, always been a big forearm guy, but yeah, really good workout overall. Just ready to keep pushing into the new year, man. Just keep working. You got it. I'm right there with you. Let's go.